एवरीवन होप यू ऑल आर हैविंग एन अमेजिंग डे टू मेक योर डे इवन मोर इंटरेस्टिंग वी एट इंटेलीपैट हैव ब्रॉट एन इंटरेस्टिंग वीडियो ऑन हाउ टू बिकम साइबर सिक्योरिटी इंजीनियर बट बिफोर वी बिगिन द सेशन मेक श्योर टू सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल एंड आल्सो हिट ऑन द बेल आइकन सो दैट यू विल नेवर मिस एन अपडेट फ्रॉम अस Here is the agenda for this session. We will begin by checking who cyber security engineer really is. Just a quick introduction. Then we will check out why we need cyber security along with the job roles. Then we will see the skills required for a cyber security engineer. We will also learn about the path to become a cyber security engineer. And last but the most interesting part, salary of a cyber security engineer. So to begin with, who is a cyber security engineer? Well, cyber security engineer are the people who identify threats and vulnerabilities in systems of an organization. They are highly skilled and use those skills to design and develop high-tech solutions to ensure that they are secure if they are attacked by cyber criminals. Now, let's see what work a cyber security engineer does in a company. First, implementing, managing, monitoring and upgrading security measures for the protection of an organization's data. systems and networks he also responds to all system or network security breaches ensuring that organization's data and infrastructure are protected by enabling the appropriate security measures apart from these he also participates in the change management process of a company he also have daily administrative tasks like reporting and communication with the relevant departments in the organization after doing all these work He also tests and identifies network and system vulnerabilities. Well, that's a lot of work, right? So now let's move on to why we need cyber security. Remember we talked about how many things a cyber security engineer does in a company in last part? Well, that's the reason this role is very high in demand and paid very well. Companies are getting cyber attack daily multiple times. So in order to protect their data, companies are hiring cyber security engineers. Well that's why your future is secured right if you are certified in cyber security courses your market value is raised by a lot of time as a individual professional so let's jump into knowing what are the cyber security job roles present in any company so these are the roles that are there in cyber security security architect consultant penetration tester chief information security officer cryptographer security analyst and security engineer So if any job role looks interesting to you please let us know in the comment section now let's move on to requirements that you should have before starting your career in cyber security first let me show you what companies require from the job roles of cyber security engineer IBM is hiring for cyber security analyst the candidate should have the knowledge of firewalls IDS IPS security incident and event management and even the languages that you require are also mentioned over there the certifications that you have to do ciscp oscp or any other technical certifications are also a requirement for cyber security analyst you should also know the different models that companies run against cyber attacks now let's see one more company deloitte deloitte has a requirement for an experienced professional with 3 to 4 years of experience we even see erp security as well the candidate must have the knowledge of models and tools that are shown in addition you must have experience in performing segregation of duties and mitigation risks and you even have to work with the information security and risk management teams now that you have seen companies requirements let me summarize what companies are looking for so the first and most important requirement is you must have a graduate degree in computer science or cyber security or information science or any related field apart from these you should understand the architecture administration and management of operating systems like linux windows mac etc you should be very good at vulnerability testing it is a process that detects and classifies security loopholes in the infrastructure you should also know basic networking like routers and switches in other words get to know and love things like firewalls and network load balancers Just a quick info guys at Intellipath we provide cyber security online training in collaboration with EC council completely mentored with industry experts for more information about the course please do contact our course advisors 
Now let's continue with the session. This also need to understand more common programming languages including C, C++, disassemblers, assembly language and scripting languages like PHP, Perl or Shell. Now these are the most famous tools about which you should have knowledge. Wireshark, Metasploit and Nmap are tools for Kali Linux used for testing and scanning. MySQL is a database language that will be helpful to understand data storage and how to secure it. Now we come to a phase where you will get to know how to kick start your career in cyber security field. Now there are two main certifications that are required to get into cyber security. First certified ethical hacker that is for beginners and second CCSP that's certified cloud security professional for advanced professionals. We will look into these certifications one by one. CEH course is provided by EC Council. To start your career in cyber security, you have to write this certification. This course will teach you the latest hacking tools, techniques and methodologies used by hackers and information security professionals to lawfully hack an organization. It's a 4 hour MCQ exam and if you want to increase your value even higher you can attempt for CEH practical exam that's for 6 hours as well and when you clear both of them you will earn a CEH master degree. Now these are the job roles that you get after you do the certification. Now you notice that these are just the level 1 job roles that you get. When you are new to this technology you will get basic job roles. You will get promotions and new job roles as you move up the ladder in a company. Now we have CCSP that is for professionals. A CCSP applies information security expertise to a cloud computing environment. It also demonstrates competence in cloud security architecture design and operations. Now for this candidates must have experience of 5 years into information technology or any other related field. Now if you have experience in other fields except this then you are not qualified to get a certification in this. And these are the job roles that you have after you do this certifications. Now you notice that the, these job roles are very very highly paid and these are very important in any company. When you start getting experience and knowledge you will be paid more than anyone in an organization. And the reason behind this is you are protecting the critical information of the company. If that information is leaked the company might get heavy losses or it might shut down. And now comes the most interesting part. You will know how much a cyber security engineer earn. I have divided the salary into two parts for better understanding. One is for beginners and second is for professionals. If you get any job role after CEH certifications, you will earn $104,500 annually. While in India, you will earn 3.5 up to 6 LPA based on your experience. For professionals, you can earn up to $2 million a year and 30 LPA in India. That's a lot of money, right? One more interesting thing is, these are the companies that are hiring for cybersecurity engineers. All these companies are very big, right? So getting a lot of money and working in such big companies really gets you excited. That's it for this stream and I hope you guys liked it and learned from it. So stay tuned for more from IntelliPad. Just a quick info guys, at IntelliPath we provide cyber security online training in collaboration with EC Council, completely mentored with industry experts. For more information about the course, please do contact our course advisors.